welcome back to my channel my name is Riyad and I hope you all have been in the very best of health Alhamdulillah I've been doing so great so today I will be making a nikop tutorial using the surgical mask the situation of things right now is so sudden everything being jeopardized because of this virus across the globe no um, schools being shut down offices being closed not being able to go to gatherings like our daily activities are being jeopardized because of this thing so what i think we should do right now is we should all just ask god for forgiveness because he is the only one who can bring us out of this thing and i i pray and hope that everything ends soon like my god you go to stores and you cannot find food like people i don't know it's so sad how people also buy things like things you know are good for everybody things you know are beneficial to everybody and you cannot just take like they say love your neighbor as you love yourself that's how they say in god people have already gone to stores to get things ahead of some people and instead of them to leave things for those that are still coming now they did not do that they all took other things. so right now all stores most stores are being closed down because of this thing we can't get sanitizers we can't get tissue papers we can get soaps i don't know everything is just like and all we need right now is prayer prayer for forgiveness prayer for mercy prayer for guidance like ramadan is coming and i'm so excited ramadan is coming and i'm praying to god almighty to please end this pandemic before ramadan comes in like we all know that ramadan is uh, a month of mercy like a month of blessings a month of guidance a month of all things positive so i'm i'm praying and hope that everything ends soon and we all enjoy our ramadan like it's so sad that mosques are also like we can go to the masjid right now like the same i don't know why all this is happening uh, but this is happening for good yeah and this is the best time for us to move closer to god almighty this is the best time for us to read our quran this is the best time for us to read our bibles read the word of god from there let like us make our video today so I would love to do Ramadan vlog this year so I don't know if you all want it please let me know so I can look forward to it I pray that everything ends soon and thank you so much for watching this video and let's get right into the video so I'm going to show us two ways to use this surgical mask as a child is so the first way is putting this surgical mask like inside like under your hijab and the second way is putting it outside after you've used your hijab so this is what i'm going to start with i'm going to start with this one putting it inside and let's let's start so because i'm wearing this now i won't be showing you how i'm going to put this roof inside but i know this is easier for everybody to use like it's the same normal thing how you put it around your hairs the back of your hair so that's how i'm going to do now and i'm going to and i'm going to show you um to wrap my scarf over it so i'm going to use this one under my cap now at the back uh before i start this okay let me see this surgical mask has the up and the down one so the one up the one that's going to be around the nose is the one that has like uh, a metal inside 
that's the one that's going to be up and the one that does not have anything is going to be down so that is how you use the surgical mask so this one has to be up the one that has the metal right here you see right here Okay, let's see. That's a difference. This one has this metal in here to here, and this one doesn't have anything here. So the one that has like this metal here is going to be up. So let's go. You put this one in your nose, or let me start. The same thing to the second one. Uh, make sure you pull this make sure it covers your chin and this is going to be up like this you see that's it that's how to use it under it and I am going to wrap my scarf over it so I'm using this scarf okay. perspective of whether you want to show your scarf your under scarf or not you can show you want to do on the shoulders the wall you do it like this and this is the small one and this is the long side and you grab your pin here and secure here it on top and see check here and wrap it's just a normal way So now I'm using this wrench to secure this place to make this turn. That's it. So, and you can adjust your stuff. And because I am sitting down on the floor, I'm sitting down, so this is how it looks. That's it. Yeah. And that's it. This is how you use it. Okay. Okay. So, that's it. That's how you use it. And so let's go to the next one, which one, which is the second option. Okay. So this is the second one. The second one is you using the surgical mask outside your scalp. Like, you know, the first one was used inside, but this one is gonna be outside. So you start by using your scalp first, or your hijab by using 
wrapping your hijab first and now this one I'm gonna leave um, I'm gonna pull them my inner cap out a little bit so as to cover because that's gonna be showing unlike the first one that is in sh that did not show so gonna that's gonna be the one we use first so you grab your pin to secure you like we did the first one you grab your pin to secure you under here okay and we have the small one and the long one like the one before and you can use any of the, st the style you want to use but this I'm going to use the same style as the first one and it's a simple one that everybody uses so it doesn't take time that's it and I'll grab my brush my brush like I grabbed it earlier and secure it right here again that's it and you have it like this here and this is the style that we have here and if you don't not if you're not comfortable with this one showing just pull it right here and pull it like this okay that is done and that's it so the the next one is taking your surgical mask and using it the same way as described in the first bit in the first method and like this not that long for me to like tie so i'm gonna use a safety pin and that's it that's it in each way you want to use your um, surgical mask please and please make sure you use them correctly and I forgot to say this like we have two different sides this that has this one on the outside that's the one that's going to be outside and this is going to be inside as I'm showing you right now so so that will be it for today and i hope you enjoyed watching this video and thank you so very much for watching and before i leave i would like to advise you all that we should all keep ourselves very very safe by washing our hands with soap and water thoroughly like wash your hands with soap and water for at least 20 seconds so as to make sure everything is clean and please don't forget to sanitize your hands every time and make sure uh you take precaution on putting things in your nose putting things in your mouth so please and please everybody needs to be safe everything happens for a reason and one of these reasons is for us to be more closer to God Almighty and I hope and pray that I pray that Allah answers our prayers and please don't forget to ask for forgiveness every time and please and please be safe so 
thank you and i'll see you in my next video bye bye